Lexus driver here. And uh, guess what? This is the new airport in uh, Cebu, Makatan International Airport. It um, looks really, looks really modernizing, wood, and um, yeah, it's really, really, really one of those, one of the most modernizing airports here in uh, Cebu. And hopefully, there might be more modernizing airports here in the Philippines. And uh, the one thing I like about this airport is one. It's uh, it's um, it's more gigantic. It's more gigantic, huge, and um, yeah, a lot of room to breathe because of this uh, giant roof up here. And um, if you look right here, there's like um, a recyclable and non-recyclable bins all together. And uh, check-in gates, uh, well, uh, check-in areas, they're like right here. Very. Um, very modernizing. Uh, there are some metal. Uh, there are some metal added to this uh, airport, but I'd say most of the roof is uh, is wood. So we just finished. Uh, me and my parents just finished checking in, and um, we're just uh, gonna be paying our ter terminal fees before we're going through security, and then we'll be trying the Mabuhay Lounge. Hopefully, uh, hopefully that would apply to economy class passengers uh, with upgrades or whatnot. So um, we're going to Bangkok and after that we'll take a flight from Bangkok and then we'll go to Chiang Mai uh, which, is, um, which is up north in, uh, in Thailand. Okay, so we've, we just finished going through uh, security. Now we're going through like uh, uh, through the gates uh, to, uh, to our planes and um, I might uh, try going to the lounge, but hopefully uh, we might be getting there. Anyway, there's like a lot of goodies here. Really a lot of goodies, but um, hopefully we can try the airline lounges, but yeah. Let's go here now at... Um, so we're here now at the, um, at the gates. Well, I might have mentioned it in the, another video. So here we are at the gates, the snack area. So um, uh, we're gonna be uh, we're gonna be eating something light and um, hopefully uh, something else. Uh, we can eat. Uh, we can actually get something to eat uh, before our flight. It's just gonna be a three-hour flight from Cebu to Bangkok. This is the new jet bridge and so I really love this jet bridge, really reminds me of Hamad International Airport. So uh, all aboard! Here I am guys, this is the uh, Airbus A321-200, it's, it's a really old plane but uh, still flyable and has done a lot of uh, miles under its belt, and um, yeah, so no IFB system, but my my old smart my own smartphone is also an IFE, so I can enjoy some movies, TV shows, and whatnot uh, on the air without even have to worry about uh, uh, televisions uh, uh, making me think of uh, IFEs and. So uh, it's gonna be an amazing flight. So uh, uh, enjoy.
here's the uh, new, well not really new, but the latest airport here in Bangkok, Thailand, Suvarnabhumi International Airport. And uh, yeah, it's, it's really a lot like uh, uh, Dubai International Airport, except amazing designs and also some Thai culture. And also even even a temple makeshift temple and yeah a lot of good a lot of uh, amazing designs of this big airport and looks like it's very late here in uh, Bangkok so I'm pretty tired I didn't sleep uh, the entire flight uh, from Manu from uh, Cebu to Bangkok so um, I'm guessing tonight gonna be sleeping and hopefully I'll be refreshed for the morning so I would say uh, I might I might add some more features uh, to this uh, video until the until the end and well, we'll see what happens all right guys so um, I'm now here at the um, at the exit gates. I'm actually in the arrival area of uh, Bangkok Suvarnabhumi International Airport. Um, so if, if you guys can look from here, down here this is the arrival area, but up here where you see my hand up here, this is the uh, this is the departure area like, you know. So down here is the arrival area, up there is the departure area. So, yeah, and, um, yeah, so, uh, now this is, now this is going to be different here, uh, and I find it's, a, I find it's a pretty fun joke of what I did. Um, when we went to Thailand, uh, I made a, I made something really, f I, I always, well, you'll see. <laughs> So uh, today, today here it's um, it's pretty it's pretty much sunny, but I believe it's partly cloudy here in uh, Bangkok. So yeah, here's, the, here's what it looks like. And uh, one thing I find strange, but uh, uh, not really strange, but uh, it's how they how they do it is. Um, how they drive here is a lot like uh, Britain. Um, traffic flows on the left side and the driver sits on the right side. Kind of like the opposite uh, of uh, the United States. So yeah, uh, beautiful morning and uh, hopefully uh, we might find something uh, amazing as we walk around uh, Thailand's capital city. I'd say how the train goes is um, a lot like how the roads go here, left-hand side. And uh, we'll see how we go. So let's go. So uh, we're going to Chiang Mai, so uh, we're going to be leaving 
Bangkok uh, late at night and heading to Chiang Mai. And um, yeah, but for but first we're we're taking a break. We'll explore some more of Bangkok before we go to the airport. But um, yeah, we'll see what happens. Uh, during uh, the walk in uh, Bangkok, we saw uh, there's like markets, um, even even an amazing restaurant uh, where they where they uh, uh, serve breakfast, lunch, and dinner. But anyway. Uh, we'll see some more uh, once we uh, once we take a break. But it's pretty amazing uh, walking around here in uh, Bangkok. You might take a train or something like that. here in Bangkok, Thailand and uh, we just had a very big, just had a very large dinner but um, for my dinner it was pretty spicy and so spicy it made my face numb so I had to drink something to cool my mouth but all in all it's, uh, it's really an amazing dinner uh, my family had at the, this, this restaurant we went through it's a restaurant, a bar and a cafe in Called the Coffee Club, and I would highly recommend it for someone who likes to run errands for you know getting a cup of coffee, or if you want to uh, hang out with friends and companions, you can you know uh, go there for a drink, or if you're in the mood to, or if you want to eat breakfast, lunch, or dinner, you can just uh, go there and order some meals uh, and dine in or take it out. So. Uh, yeah, so uh, updates on, on uh, visiting Thailand. So tomorrow we're going to be going to, uh, uh, we're going to be leaving Bangkok, so I would say goodbye Bangkok, and uh, we're going to be heading to uh, my dad's hometown. So um, tomorrow we'll see, uh, we'll see what happens next. So uh, upon arrival at Chiang Mai, it's going to be the end of part one of this, uh, this entire so part two is going to be all, all through Chiang Mai. So uh, yeah, um, once they've uh, made the final part of the video, so reach Chiang Mai, and we'll see what happens. So anyway, uh, good night. Right now, me and my family are here at Suvarnabhumi International Airport, a second busiest airport here in Bangkok after Don Mueang International Airport. And um, we're gonna be flying Thai Smile to Chiang Mai, so uh, let's go. All right, so we just finished checking in and going through security. So uh, right now we're, um, we're right now going to uh, gate eight. Uh, we're going to our gate, uh, our designated gate uh, for our for our flight, and um, yeah. So uh, we'll see what's it like flying uh, the subsidiary of Thai Airways. Uh, there's a there's a good place where we can get a quick bite before reporting our flight, and um, yeah. So this. This is really the first time flying uh, one of one of the airlines as well. Uh, any airlines uh, subsidiary, like Philippine Airlines, is subsidiary is Pal Express. Uh, Thai Airways, is subsidiary is uh, Thai Smile. American Eagle is the subsidiary of American Airlines. 
uh, United Airlines, the uh, subsidiary is um, United Express. Delta Connect is um, the subsidiary of Delta Airlines. So uh, let's, uh, let's see what happens. So uh, the amazing things about uh, this airport, uh, walkways, you get to walk fast, and uh, yeah, a lot like uh, the airport in either in Dubai or in Abu Dhabi. Okay, so we're here at the um, at the gate at our at the designated gate uh, to our flight uh, to Chiang Mai, and yes, this is uh, the um, the plane that's the subsidiary of Thai Airways, Thai Smile A320. So uh, we're gonna be sitting here and waiting till our flight's ready. So uh, I'll be back with you shortly. Like we're ready to board so uh, let's see what they have to offer while we're flying this plane here we are guys on board Thai Smile so um, so since this is a subsidiary of Thai Airways um, this is the plane we're going to be flying. This is an A3, A320 200 Chocolate, which is, um, which is a newer generation, but just the same engine, but a redesigned uh, wing, wing tip called the Chocolate. So, um, we're going to be flying off shortly. Yeah, 
าติเชียงใหม่เป็นที่เรียบร้อยแล้วค่ะขณะนี้เป็นเวลา16นาฬิกา40นาทีตัวความปลอดภัยของท่านก็ได้ Yeah, we're really way up north in Thailand, so um, we're going through security checks, grabbing our baggage before we head off into uh, our hotel. So uh, looking forward to it, and yeah, so we're gonna be going to get our bags, going through security checks, and then finally. Now in Chiang Mai, my dad's hometown. So we're here in the hotel with my mom. So, um, so yeah, uh, here we are, rainy Chiang Mai. If, if I would say sunny Chiang Mai, if it's sunny, but um, really looking forward to uh, uh, the day of uh, walking around in Chiang Mai. So we had, to, we had to switch hotels because uh, the hotel we went first, um, unfortunately, we got a room, but we can only stay for one day due to a full booking on those on those hotels. But uh, fortunately, we're uh, we're in a hotel near my aunt's uh, uh, business. Uh, uh, so yeah. I find this hotel is going to be really comfy and uh, good amenities uh, for the rest of our trip uh, here in Thailand. So here we are in uh, our hotel uh, here in Chiang Mai. So yeah, two beds as usual, but um, I feel like uh, this hotel they might uh, they might have to do some renovations because you know it's a really old hotel, but highly recommend. But uh, anyway, that's, uh, that's, how it, uh, that's how it goes. Like uh, like when a hotel gets old, time for some renovations as usual. But still, uh, amazing hotel. And um, I believe it's uh, nearly sunset. Here, if you want to subscribe, and also click here for 